Hey everyone, hope you're having a great day. Today we're doing another experiment and we're going to make our own dishwasher tabs. Uh, the ones you buy in the store aren't very healthy for you, if, especially if they stay on the dishes. Um, there's just a lot of chemicals in them and I want to try to make my own and I hope it's safer. I mean, I don't know what Arm & Hammer Super washing soda is made of because I don't think you can grow washing soda in the dirt. But hopefully less chemicals overall on this and then we'll put it in the dishwasher and give it a try. My dishwasher is full and ready to go. So we're going to make them. It doesn't take long at all. Put it in the dishwasher and see how the dishes come out. So I typically don't measure. I uh, looked up this recipe already and there's so many different recipes and varieties um, and ways of making it. So we're just going to pour and see how much it makes. So that is super washing soda. We're going to do baking soda. You can also add borax too if you want. Um, I use branch, branch basics for my cleaning and soap. And so I'm going to use branch basics as the soap to go inside of this. You can use regular dish soap um, or you can use dish soap or you can use um, cast style soap. Whatever you want to use, just don't use very much because you're not supposed to put soap into your appliances. So I'm just going to put a tiny little bit, little drizzle. This is concentrated, so a little will go a long way. And then you can do vinegar or lemon juice, whatever you want to do. I need to get a spoon out. Okay, so when you add the vinegar, it's going to bubble. It's going to have that chemical reaction. So you just pour a little. Stir, pour a little and stir, a little more, stir, Okay, so that is all stirred up. Let me show you the consistency we have right now. This will quickly solidify and dry into a cube. So let's work quick. We are going to Okay, it's already it's already starting to solidify. So I'm going to add a little bit more vinegar to soften it up. That way I can work with it. Okay. Get in there with my hands. Quickly, hopefully. Okay. So these are ice cube trays with silicone bottoms so they can pop out easily. And you want to push down firmly so that they form a solid cube. They're already doing it. Already forming a solid cube. Okay, 
See, you got to work fast because now this is solid and I can't get them nice and neat, which, which is fine. I don't care what they look like when they go in the dishwasher as long as they work. So this is solidified again. Um, oh, I hope that wasn't too much. Okay. Loosen it up. pour it in. No, that's probably not a good idea. Oh, I hope I didn't add too much. <clears throat> so this is a good example of why you measure and follow instructions because you end up with soup. We'll see. We'll see how this turn out. So yeah, do as I say, not as I do. Read the instructions. I think we'll use this liquid just to top some of these off. These aren't super deep trays, so these cubes should be the right size to fit in the dishwasher. Uh, where you put the pods in my dishwasher, you have to close the lid on it. So hopefully this all works out. If not, I'll break them in half if I can, whatever I need to do. Shove them in there. Okay. So these are already solid except for that little bit I added to the top. So we will give them a few minutes to solidify. So I'm going to spread it out and see if that helps. All right, see you back in a sec. All right, after just a few minutes, look at that. That liquidy mess that I had in here is starting to solidify a little bit. So I got out a third tray and we're just gonna add this little bit to those trays and they'll probably just take longer to, to dry and solidify, but that's fine. We'll wait for them. We made four more.
Yep. Okay. Let me see. Hold it like that for you. Okay. Still a little mushy. We'll give them a few more minutes. And then we'll pop them out. We'll store them in a Ziploc. And we'll put one in the dishwasher. Okay. They are solid now. Oh, these ones are. Okay. Not all of them, but close enough. I've been very impatiently patient. So we're just going to, we're going to pop them out, even though they're not perfectly dry yet. I don't want to wait any longer. So with the silicone bottom, you can just push. So this one could have been filled in a little bit more and pushed down a little bit harder. This one's okay. Most, most of these are okay. Oh, see, that's solid enough. That'll do the job, or it should. And then some of these might fall apart. So um, if yours turns out like that when, when you try to make this, uh, just be careful, I guess. Don't shake the bag up whenever you put them in there to store them. And then if you end up with a bunch of crumbs at the bottom of the bag, you can just put all those crumbs in the dishwasher tab compartment. And I'm sure it'll work just fine that way. Okay, so we're going to put one of these in the dishwasher now. Yep. So this dishwasher is a newer dishwasher and your dishes have to be dirty in order for them to come out clean. The dirtier the dishes, the cleaner they'll come out. I know it sounds counterintuitive, but um, so this dishwasher is full and disgusting and we'll see if it comes out clean. With these smart dishwashers, they um, have a a sensor in there that can detect how how dirty the water is so they'll either work really hard to get the dishes clean or they won't all right i'm gonna put these did i finish my thought they're gonna they're gonna uh, scan the water to see how dirty it is and they'll work harder to get the water clean so they think the dishes is clean it thinks the dishes is clean um, if the water's clean because you rinsed your dishes off, then it won't, the washer won't work very hard to get the dishes clean and they might actually be dirty when it comes out. So the dishwasher is loaded, it's running, the dishes are filthy, and we'll see how well one of these tabs works. I will let you know in a few hours how it turns out. All right, let's take a look at this dishwasher and see how those tabs did. Don't mind the mess on the counter. That's just my dishwasher tabs I left out to dry. This thing was dirty. And look at that, sparkling clean, perfect. Dishwasher tabs did an amazing job. Look at all those squeaky clean dishes. That looks good. I'm pretty impressed with those dishwasher tabs. I'm going to keep using them.